Hello, beautiful people. I hope that all is well in your world, wherever you are. And this day has been a very, very successful day for you and all of your wonderful, wonderful black loved ones. <clears throat> My beautiful intelligent black brothers and sisters know this that only an individual can rise to the heights of consciousness and awareness. I have witnessed throughout my life on this planet. I have, I have been on this planet for many, many decades. And I, I have witnessed too many folks adhere to being attached to the crowd, needing the crowd to validate them, to accept them in some respect from my perspective. The more you belong to the crowd, the deeper you fall into darkness from my perspective, my beautiful, black, intelligent brothers and sisters. Know this, they are all conspirators. They are all conspirators. The entire lily white racist Republican Party has conspired with Trump and the Russians since the inception of Trump's, Trump's uh, decision to run for the president of the wealthiest country on the planet. Trump has so much blood on his hands more than 30,000 Americans have died from this COVID-19 disease that could have been gotten under control had Trump not spent six to eight weeks denying the existence of this killer virus that has taken over the world. They have conspired to denounce the pandemic. From their perspective, this pandemic was a democratic construct, a hoax created by the Democrats to hurt the Republican Party and Trump. They, the Republican Party, they, Trump administration, conspired to denounce the impeachment. The man broke the law, period. He offered a quid pro quo. If you scratch my back, I will scratch yours. And he got caught. He was impeached. The Republican Party conspired to denounce it, to refute it, and gave Trump the green light to do whatever Trump decides that he wants to do. They conspired to force the Ukraine president to investigate a political rival. They conspired to hoard PPE, ventilators, gowns, 
mask, selling them for exorbitant prices while medical workers are being infected. They refused to orchestrate the procurement and distribution of medical equipment during a pandemic. More Americans have died because of it. Trump and his administration, the Republican Party, have blood on their hands, my beautiful black brothers and sisters. They have conspired to open the economy and allow more Americans to die because their own political gains and power addictions are much more important to them, my beautiful black brothers and sisters. Trump has much blood on his hand. They conspired to use a quid pro quo tactic to gather favors from other countries, to gather favors from Republican governors, to gather favors from Republican senators, using the medical equipment as a motivator, as a payoff for the quid pro quo tactic that they use. The Republican Party, the Trump administration, are owned by Wall Street, by the big banks, by the Fortune 500s, by wealthy white folks, and by big oil and big gas. They have blood on their hands. They are all conspirators. They are all traitors from my perspective, my beautiful black brothers and sisters. That's what I have on this one. Please go to the thrasherway.libsyn.com to gain access to all of my dissertations to all of my audio podcasts and going forward to all of my videos. Talk to you again on another one real soon.